Shang Peng, San Jose Hockey Now. Will the Sharks trade Timo Meyer? My guess is yes, but they do not have to trade him by the March 3rd trade deadline. A couple weeks ago, an NHL executive told me that he expects that the Sharks will get a Bo Horvat-like return for Meyer in trade. Now, that may not seem that high. That's basically a first-round pick, a grade B prospect like Atu Rati. And a young but not spectacular player like Anthony Beauvillier. Now keep in mind though, I got pushed back on that from a couple of sources that said that the Sharks will hold out for a larger return for Meyer because of these reasons, these differences. Horvat was a pending UFA, a rental, so pay the rental price for him. Whereas Meyer's an RFA, whatever team is acquiring him will have him this year and next. Also too, right now, Meyer is probably the lone elite scoring option out there in the trade market. And so the Sharks should hold out for those couple of reasons. Makes sense, right? Now, will the Sharks get that huge price that they want for Timo Meyer? I think it's gonna depend mainly on this. Whether or not teams outside of the Sharks see Timo Meyer as a franchise cornerstone guy, as a guy that you want to commit eight years, he's gonna be expensive, that you wanna commit long-term to on your team. If a couple teams do see Timo Meyer in that way and not just as a one or two year boosted or offense, then yeah, I can see Timo Meyer getting a huge return for the Sharks. Now, I wanted to add one note. Vladimir Tarasenko was traded today from the Blues to the Rangers. Didn't get a huge return. Spoke with the source. I don't think Vladimir Tarasenko's price will affect Timo Meyer's price really. Tarasenko's 31 was a great sniper. But right now, though, Meyer is seen as a clearly better player than Tarasenko. And so I don't think there's any real comparison between the two right now.